Hello, it's the Germanic, and I'm here to show you how to get some nice settings so you can record good quality footage with your HD PVR. Assume by now you have set it up in the right way. Uh, you, if you haven't, then just make sure you do that first. It's a very important step. Um, by the way, this tutorial applies to both Xbox 360 and PS3, so you don't need to worry about um, what console you're playing on. So let's get started. You need to open up Total Media Extreme, which is a program which you get with the PVR itself, and go onto the first tab and go on to Record Video. Then a screen like this should pop up. Uh, basically follow what I do in this video and copy these exact settings if you want to get exactly the same quality as myself. So if you if uh, your Xbox 360 doesn't show up, make sure that you refresh in the top. Um, just click refresh on the top left, and it should be on, it should be called Halparg HD PVR capturing device. And once you've got the picture up, then you need to, you need to put these in. The input video should be set to YPR PB. That's a capital two B, uh, t capital two P. So Y, capital uh, P R, capital P B. The audio input should be RCA black, and the PC audio mode must be set to two channel stereo. You can go into the cap uh, device settings, but it should work without you changing anything there. I set mine to PAL B, so you can do the same. Um, just play around to see if there is a considerably uh, there is a considerable difference between whether you put it on NTS or whatever. So uh, next are the format settings, which are very important, and make sure that you have exactly the same settings as these. I have my bitrate set at six megabits per second, but it really depends on how much memory you have on your computer. Own I only have 250 gigabytes, so I set it down from. 30.5 which is the max to a bit rate which is still very good quality but much less it takes up much less memory and that can be good if you don't have a particularly good computer I've seen videos where I guess people have used the highest bit rate possible and they look identical to the ones that I've produced so you might as well just tone it down however however if you do have an external hard drive there's no reason why you shouldn't put it as high as as high as you want. If you can boost the analog signal and make um, make sure uh, you can boost the analog signal if you want, and also make sure that the L Luma and Chroma is set to zero. And to end, make sure that you use the AC3 audio encoder, AC3, not AAC. Finally, make sure you click on PS3, PlayStation 3. It will see, you'll see it in the uh, bottom left corner, not Xbox 360, even if you're not using one. When I tried to use the Xbox MP4 codec on Sony Vegas, my editing program, which I use to edit my videos, uh, the video, the audio, I mean, uh, was out of sync. So I tried the PS3 one and uh, it worked perfectly. So uh, I stuck with that. And that's it for. Uh, today. Uh, I'm doing the second part of this video on how to render on Sony Vegas for posting to YouTube. Until then, bye!